The Iranian culture is so vibrant. It's so warm. When you go into Iran, after you get past the fear, the initial fear, and you get home, it's family. The country's been hijacked, and the culture has been hijacked, and that all those good people have been denied the right to really enjoy and celebrate life, and so much of that is what our culture has been about. The opportunities that we have here, they don't even know what those opportunities are. They don't have them. A lot of the women in Iran, they don't have a job of substance, and it's because it's kind of stigma for, for women to be demoted into these little hospitality uh, jobs and not to go anywhere beyond that. You know, when they start off, the girls are really quick to, to answer you, and they're really smart and feisty, and then as they grow up, it's dulled down because it's like bashed in their heads. Like, don't speak, don't laugh, don't talk. They may change faces with their leaders and whatnot, but they're using Islam, they're using religion as a tool. I want to see the last 30 years reversed. I would love to see the women to be able to rise up and have a voice of their own. I want to see that change. I want to see the girls stand up. And that's big. <laughs>